Good investors, are you ready for what's coming up this fall? I mean, the year has been not what we expected. We have high inflation, we have high interest rate, there's a war going on, a recession is definitely brewing, and a lot of investors are expecting a market crash. Are you ready for that? Like, how's your portfolio right now? How do you feel about the market? Uh, let's take a moment to look at a few charts and look at the state of the market. So first things first, inflation, both in Canada and in the US, it is ridiculous, right? It's been like 30 years we haven't seen such a high inflation rate. Even though right now it seems that the inflation growth is slowing down, we're still having like seven, eight, nine percent inflation compared to last year. So it is hurting your budget. It is hurting your portfolio because when there's a high inflation, companies' margin are hurt. There's raw material cost goes higher and they struggle to maintain their profit. So here's come central banks saying, hey, you know what? We're going to save the day. We're going to kill the big, bad inflation and we're going to increase our rates like there's no tomorrow. We had that in the Fed. They did it again in August. Bank of Canada, no different. In September, increased the rate again. And you know what? Chances are we're going to have more rate increase coming up. What it means to you? Well, it means that the stock market will don't, won't do well. Companies will have a debt burden that will keep growing and on your side as an investor, as a consumer, it's gonna cost much. It's gonna cost much because of inflation, but it's also going to cost much if you have any debts. Uh, you know, in North America, we had this bad habit of turning around to our house, remortgaging as an uh, ATM machine, just get money out of it. And now we're gonna realize that interest rates are real and they hurt because debt level are through the roof. Uh, the housing market has been a big part of our economy and this is another thing where another reason why I believe that there's a real recession coming up. I know the Fed said during summertime, oh, it's not really a recession. Even if we have two quarters of consecutive uh, economic growth going down, which is the exact definition of a recession, they say, oh, it's not there yet because they pull out a few graphs. Um, among those graphs, they're gonna show you that still the economy is going down, but not by that much. So it's not really a recession in that sense. And the most important part is everybody has a job. So unemployment rate has been to the lowest level possible. It's pretty much at the perfect level for in terms of the economy, because you're always going to find a few people that are not able to find job. But in the meantime, all consumers can count on their paycheck, they continue to spend, so they're not really worried about that part. But let's be honest, once they realize that their mortgage payments are increasing, their car payments are increasing, and on top of that, when they go to the grocery store, oh my God, inflation is killing their budget. What's gonna happen? More layoffs, probably that some companies will have to cut their dividend, and we're, we might add into a correction that will be a little bit harder than what we have seen in 2022 so far. So what do you do at this point? I mean, if you're like me, you're in your 30s or your 40s, you don't have to mind much. You follow your plan, you invest in the market while it's down, it's just a great bargain. But if you're a retiree and you count on your portfolio to generate income, where does that leave you? I mean, you work super hard for your money. You make sacrifices. You invested throughout all those years. You shouldn't suffer from the market. You shouldn't endure dividend cuts. But there are a lot of uncertainties in this market right now. And the fear of losing capital, losing income is real. And if you don't do anything with your portfolio, you might end up into a very bad situation. For that reason, I decided to do an exclusive webinar on Thursday, September 22nd, where I will address those problematics. So we're going to look at the state of the market, what it means to you, and then I'm going to propose you a plan so you can protect your portfolio, make sure you don't suffer from major losses, because even though it's going to go down anyways, there's not much to do about it besides sitting in cash. But if you sit in cash, you don't generate income. So I'm going to show you how you can protect a part of your portfolio and at the same time generate some income so you can retire happy and you don't have to worry about what's coming up this fall. So don't forget, September 22nd, link to register the webinar 100% free is right there in the link description below. Uh, if you cannot make it on September 22nd, if you just registered, you're going to receive the replay link 100% free again. So 
And if you can make it to the live event, I'm going to answer all your question after the presentation. So it's about an hour of presentation and an hour of Q and A. And believe me, I can answer all kinds of questions. I've been following the market for that moment all the time. So I'll be just happy to help you out and uh, manage your portfolio, invest with conviction and retire happy. All right, guys. So give me a thumbs up, share this YouTube video with your friends, those who are concern about the market and maybe those who would like to spend two hours with me on September 22nd for the webinar. This is a rendezvous and until the next video, don't forget to stay invested.